If you want to know what the heck I spent my money on this week, then keep watching. This video is for you. Hey there, thanks for watching. My name is Christiana and my channel is The Well-Behaved Wallet, where my goal is to love the life I have while building a life of my dreams. I am on a mission to get out of debt and live prosperously. Currently, my only debt is my student loan with a starting balance of 20,000. I am down to 13,800. So in today's video, I'm going to tell you what I spent my money on over the last uh, seven days in the category and the variable spending category. So that's groceries, gas, miscellaneous, personal care, things like that. Um, and the reason I do this is to A, keep myself accountable, but B, to kind of give you an idea of my day to day and what that looks like. Um, so the theme already for this month has been best of times, worst of times. <laughs> so... Um, it's been a little bit rocky and it's like, you know, in the Dave Ramsey community, the, the whole idea of, um, if there's a storm on the horizon or your rainy day fund or rain starting to fall, let me tell you, the rain is starting to fall. And I have seen it. I saw it coming at the beginning of the year. Um, and I guess by the grace of God alone, um, it's held off for this long and, um, it's, uh, it's definitely starting to rain. So, um, definitely mixed emotions and I'm being super vague right now just because, um, that's how it's going to be through the end of this month until I know a little bit more and then I will disclose more. All I can say is my income will probably be changing, hopefully not too much, but we'll see. Um, but it's times like these that I'm really grateful that I have a handle on my numbers and I know what's coming in and going out, um, and what needs to come in, uh, to go out. So that's where that is. So let me get right into the numbers and I will, uh, get those started right here. Today is Wednesday, June 5th. So far for the first five days in the month, here is my spending. I spent $30 on gas, $70 on groceries, and $45 on miscellaneous expenses. Um, and that includes uh, parking in the city and a concert ticket to a nonprofit orchestra that I didn't play in but went in to see the concert, uh, which was cheaper. I saved about um, two thirds of what I would have spent if I had gone in and actually played the concert because I would have had to pay for parking um, and bridge toll three times. So, well, four times. So that was, was actually a savings. And because it was charitable nonprofit 501c3, I can deduct a, a contribution in kind um, from my business. So that was my spending for a total of 145.50 for the first five days of the month. Um, so for groceries, $70, $70 is a little bit high. I understand. Um, and this is, even though I had some really decent buys, uh, actually, you know what? I am going over my numbers now. Fail. I only spent, I mean, this isn't much better, but 66, not 70. <laughs> Whole $4 difference, but makes a big difference. Uh, every dollar is precious is one of my, uh, someone commented, I'm like, yes, that's so true. So total spending of 141.50, my bad. Um, I'm glad I do this. So, um, so my grocery spending for this week included, um, uh, the following I mentioned in one of my, in my videos, um, I got contact solution, uh, for $10 and then Zyrtec for allergy meds, uh, for 23 from Costco, which is the cheapest $23 total, which is the cheapest. I've found both of those things anywhere. Uh, food town. I picked up some produce just because it was lo local. It was on, it was on my way. So yes. Could I get produce cheaper from a farmer's market? Absolutely. Did it fit into my schedule for the time that I had? Yes. Um, and then the Dollar Tree, I made two stops to the Dollar Tree and I spent $36 there and that was like my entire household. So I would have spent comparable, I would say at least double there. Um, and I got blue fro frozen blueberries and broccoli. These are two of my favorite things to get at the Dollar Tree because a buck for like 12 to 16 ounces of frozen blueberries is phenomenal. And I have that as like my, my nighttime snack instead of ice cream. It's uh, amazing and I love it. Um, so I got blueberries, broccoli, toothpaste, razors, um, dryer sheets, and like breath strips. Um, in the first trip and the second trip, I got my morning energy drinks, water, and sugar-free cookies for snacking. Um, so that I'm considering that a pretty big win um, for spending for groceries this week. Um, so that's I'm so my budget. I try to budget fifty dollars, and I feel like that's I know that's not super realistic. Um, and I may have to raise that up to a hundred because I am feeding two people and we do eat healthy. So, um, I may need to revisit that, um, and cut down in other ways. So that's just something I may have to look into. So that's that. Um, okay. So that's my spending for the week. And again, 
it's raining. It's it's starting to rain. <laughs> so these uh, these frugal frugal check-ins, what I spent <laughs> what I spend is gonna go down um, because these are this is for the future. I could I go out and start spending on credit cards? Absolutely. Could I take out loans? Sure. Um, but I'm not gonna do that. And this is just this is this is what I'm doing. So. That's my What I Spent Wednesday uh, for the first week of the month. Thank you for watching, and as always, I hope you will keep watching. Bye.